Hello today's video we have the following content. The story of Rose, compared with the fairy sister Liu Yifri, it turns out that she is the biggest winner in the play. In the TV series The Story of Rose, everyone thought that Wang Yumri, played by Liu Yifri, was a winner in life. Because she was born in a scholarly family, her parents are professors at Tsinghua University, and her brother loves her. She is also very outstanding, and the people around her are all highly educated and high-quality friends. Wang Yimri, who has strong learning ability and is serious about her career, looks really good. None of her colleagues in the company succeeded in making an appointment with the person the boss wanted to make an appointment with. Wang Yimri used an unexpected trick to successfully help the boss make an appointment. But as the plot develops, it turns out that Fang Taichu is the biggest winner in the play. Some people say that all roads lead to Rome. But some people are born in Rome. For example, Fang Taichu, the daughter of Liu Yifri in the play, was born at the top. Fang Taichu's grandparents are professors at Tsinghua University, and her father Lin Jenkson is handsome and educated, and is the boss of a large company. Her mother Wang Yimi is also a fairy sister with a high education. She can relax when she wants to relax and pursue her career when she wants to pursue her career. No matter what she wants to do, she can succeed. Both her uncle and aunt are highly intelligent and good-looking. Her uncle runs an architectural design company, and her aunt is a senior executive of a large company. Fang Taichu is not only the darling of the family, but even her mother's ex-boyfriend and current boyfriend treat her very well and really like her. Even her parents' divorce did not affect her healthy growth. The main reason is that her mother's original family is very good. Even after the divorce, her mother Wang Yimi is very stable. When teaching Fang Taichu, she is very patient, never yelling at the child, and never leading the child to hate his father. She gets along with the child as friendly as friends, so well that Fang Taichu even thinks that her mother is tricking her. Having an emotionally stable mother is really a blessing for Fang Taichu to have cultivated for several lifetimes. Many people, especially divorced women, are particularly prone to emotional breakdown. Especially when facing children in the rebellious period, it is really difficult to control your emotions. Wang Yimi is very stable at all times. Wang Yimi herself also has a pair of emotionally stable parents, and she has been influenced by them since she was a child. Even if Fang Yuan takes Fang Taichu away and does not let her see her daughter. Although she missed her daughter very much, she did not go crazy. Instead, she calmly negotiated with Fang Yuan on what was best for the child. After many communications and negotiations, Fang Yuan was also moved by Wang Yimi's sincerity. When educating Fang Taichu, Wang Yimi never shouted at the top of her lungs, but always taught her earnestly. It is really lucky to meet parents with stable emotions in life. All of Fang Taichu's elders are very stable. Even his father, who sometimes impulsively beat his uncle, was healed by the stable emotions of this family. Fang Yuan beat his ex-wife's brother Wang Shenhua, and their relationship has been very tense over the years. Under Fang Taichu's coordination, Fang Yuan learned to think from the perspective of others and took the initiative to apologize to Wang Shenhua. The elders around Fang Taichu are all stable people, and everyone loves her very much. So even her biological mother Wang Yimui can't compare to her. Fang Taichu is really a child with sufficient merits and resources, and she is the winner of life in this drama. Next news. Full stop. The story of Rose's parents are the starting line for children. Fang Taichu's top-notch life is enviable. There are many female characters in the play The Story of Rose. The peerless Wang Yimi is already a winner in life. The only one who can surpass Rose is her daughter Fang Taichu. It is often said that parents are the starting line for children. This sentence is true for Taichu. Father Fang Yuan, handsome and handsome, was admitted to a prestigious university through his own efforts. After graduating with a master's degree, he seized the opportunity of the times and established an internet company, turning himself into a domineering president with a net worth of over 100 million. Mother Wang Yimri, peerless and beautiful, undergraduate degree from the Central Academy of Fine Arts, master degree from Fudan University, combines beauty and talent. After divorce, she started a gallery with her former leader and her career was booming. Grandma and Grandpa are both professors at Tsinghua University. They live in the family compound of Tsinghua University and provide their granddaughter with top educational resources and environment. Fang Taichu inherited her mother's beauty and her father's logical thinking ability. After her parents divorced, they did not remarry, and there were no half-siblings or half-brothers to share the love of her father and mother. She is still the little princess of the family, enjoying all the love. In order to be closer to Taichu, 
Fang Zhuan bought a large flat in Beijing and planned to send his daughter to study abroad. Now Fang has achieved financial freedom and is very generous to his daughter. Wang Yimei's career is also outstanding, and the gallery dividends are very generous. Fang Taichu can not only inherit her parents' appearance and IQ, but also their wealth. Her starting point is the end point that ordinary people can never reach in their lifetime. Uncle Wang's hen who dotes on his niece and was punched by Fang Zhuan in order to grab her custody. Su Zhenzhen is not only an aunt, but also a good friend of Rose. She also likes her niece very much. Fang Taichu's top class life is so enviable. Her whole family is a senior intellectual, and she is rich and beautiful. She is the winner in life. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 